Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is just going to be like a chill weekend in my life. Just going to be vlogging Saturday and Sunday after my first five day week of school. Insane. Like it was just chaos, honestly. Like we did barely any work and it was really boring. But at least I got to see like a lot of my friends on the other day, which I enjoyed. So yeah, I also went to a sleepover last night and it was really fun. I do have to get some stuff done because my parents are evil and they're making me do like extra math stuff even when we literally go in person to school five days a week. But yeah, it's, it's cool. It's fine. It's fine. Totally fine. Here's the to-do list on Notion, which I am actually using it, which is surprising. I have kind of a busy Saturday that I made myself have a busy Saturday, basically. So then I can just like chill on Sunday and maybe meet up with my friends for a bike ride, I'm thinking. Possibly. And also, I really want to get up a video for tomorrow, but I'm really not sure if that's going to happen. Also, here's my outfit. I have all my slipover stuff in the back. I really need to unpack it. But I have this sweater from Brady Melville, this layering necklace from H&M. I got that like this time last year right before everything shut down insane and <laughs> this turtleneck is literally from Kohl's uh no clue where these are but they're literally just like jeggings socks for my friends I kind of want to post something on Instagram right now because my feet is pretty stinky right now like it's just kind of like very random and not cohesive so I'm gonna try to change that this spring and summer so yeah go follow me because it's about to have a major glow up and this is what I posted two days ago all right I'm just gonna post like this draft I made yesterday when I came back from school it's like just like photos I took during the week which is so random honestly the photos are so random i just i take so many photos like really randomly oh but i want to quiz it live three times in spanish i'm just gonna post it before i overthink good i look ugly now i'm overthinking it did just change after i finished a bit of my math because it's so warm out it's like 55 degrees i think which is amazing and maybe spring is on the way or maybe this is just fake spring fooling me again but either way i am so excited the weather's nice I think I've had oatmeal maybe eight times this week, including today. But that's just because it's such an easy after-school snack that I don't even need to think about while I make it. And it's so healthy. So that's, that's literally why. And today, my mom was like, why don't you just make oatmeal? something creative i was originally thinking doing like some calligraphy we were talking about it last night my friends are so crafty and all i do is like edit videos which is like you had to be creative for that but it's like still using electronics so i want to do something creative off electronics but i cannot find my calligraphy stuff that i've never opened so i think i'm gonna just do rainbow loom for fun This is just like a new shirt I got, but like there's like a little tie. And I think it's just really cute for like spring or summer. I kind of want to do another outfit video. So I'm thinking maybe like a what I wear in a week or maybe like a spring. I don't want to do another lookbook. So maybe like some kind of spring outfit video. I'll figure it out. <laughs> I'm gonna go set up this like PB&J type of station in our kitchen because we're making PB&Js with our friends and like making sack lunches in general for like this one organization that gives them to homeless people. So just like an activity we like to do. I think we did it like Martin Luther King Jr. Day and one other time I think we've done it. So this will be like our third time doing it. And it's honestly really fun to just get together and help all or everyone help each other to make lunches for people that can't get it. And yeah, I just have to go set that up and 
then I will probably organize my calendar for the week. is clean my room because if you can see it's kind of a hot mess so not a lot i need to do today i did most of my work yesterday but something i really need to do is clean my room um i try to do that every sunday but sometimes i just get lazy and we actually got to skip sunday school for the first time in a long time like obviously it's on zoom so it feels like kind of weird to be like having this free time at 10 39 because it's like usually 10 to like 11 30 11 45 i'm gonna go thrifting today with my mom finally taking me after like going back and forth about it because of covid and she just doesn't want to take me i think also it's another bright and sunny day it's like 45 degrees right now but it's still sunny and it's gonna get out to like 63 i think today which is insane definitely feels like spring because yesterday was actually the first day of spring so both days have felt very springy which i love maybe fake spring is behind us but i think i'm gonna respond to comments for a little bit because i am a bit behind and for some reason the ones on my camera unboxing weren't loading for the longest time but it's all cool very quick second while well, i just posted like an instagram story about like the asian hate crimes that are happening right now which it really is so sad because i'll see stuff on instagram that like will repost and i'll try to repost as i try not to post repost too much because i think it takes away from the fact certain important issues when you just spam your story with reposts but i do repost quite a bit when i can but i'll see like some horrible horrible stuff because i get a lot of like what's going around the world i usually see on social media not a lot on the news i don't really watch the news a lot like they're attacking like elderly asian people and like doing really horrible things and I, it's so bad because like that's someone's grandfather that's someone's dad and they're elderly they can't like fight back and it's so so bad i don't know what is wrong with our society but i just wanted you guys to be aware that i do try to post a lot of my instagram story like to just inform everyone because even though i have a small following like i'm not i'll have people dm me be like oh this is really interesting to me i'm glad you shared it like i didn't know this like i can bring up so many examples of when people say that to me and that just makes me happy because like that's at least one more person that's educated now so that and uh i really think you guys should watch um your mom ashley's video i also follow her on instagram she's been posting a whole lot about it because she is asian and she's sharing like her own experience and how messed up it is because it is and i thought it really made me rethink because she's like so many big creators like you know addison ray even emma chamberlain hannah Loesch, they're not like posting anything about this stuff and it's insane because like it makes me think like rethink who i'm looking up to because that's like a lot of their audience and it seems like they don't even care they're posting like beach selfies and like the most random crap instead of just taking like 30 minutes to just educate yourself on it it's so bad it's really really bad but yeah really good one so I'm gonna just edit some stuff on the iPad all right so I went to Sephora 
and I got my eyeliner exchange because mine was like kind of like all dried up at the top. But then she was also say said so she said I might be like applying too much pressure when I do it. So I guess I should watch YouTube videos and even how to do that. I just like usually look up designs. But there's that, and we went to the thrift store, and I got two things that are very like thrift store aesthetic, like accessory wise. And the other two things are like, eh, but they're still cute, and for the price, I think it's pretty great. First off, this bag. Not 100% sure what that said, but it's cool. It's really cute. It's like a, like that. I'm gonna wash all of this before I wear it, but also this. I thought I could wear this with maybe like a white blouse, white turtleneck um, for a pop of color. I don't know if I have anything in this exact shade though that I match it with, or maybe I could do like monotone. Really cool ideas with that. And then... This shirt, which the brand is like H&M, but it was like cheap. I think it was like maybe four bucks. I just thought it was kind of cute and I'll wash it obviously. And then finally, Hollister jeans. All my jeans are from Hollister. I know like all my like mom style jeans are like just like straight leg and stuff because that's like the only jeans that really fit me well for that kind of style. But I found these ones that are high-waisted boyfriend jeans, which I don't think Hollister sells anything like this because I'm wearing boyfriend jeans that I got last year and I couldn't find them on the high-waisted, they're low-waisted. So really cute, no rips too, so I can wear them in the winter next year and i like like the bottom of it and yeah that's, that's all i got but the two accessories are pretty cute you have to admit this is just something nice that i got for pretty cheap it's in great quality there's no stains or anything and there is a two-day return policy also the eyeliner is from the rare beauty collection i think that's like selena gomez's i want to say but when i when i went to sephora like a while ago to get eyeliner the lady recommended this for what i wanted because it's like it has a like, good like i don't know i don't know she just recommended this let me just say do you be a man? You're my boyfriend. I've been missing a lot. You've been missing in action. This is really good. Much like. Have you ever told your viewers that they are smelly? Tell no, but you just told them. That's rude. Tell them that Bruno is very smelly dog. <laughs> Look at this bone. <laughs> hey, this is so mean. Everyone knows he's smelly, isn't he? But he's a cute smelly. Aww, his breath is stinky. I know you'll get to where you're supposed to be. I'll sleep at the post. Alright. Just make a shot. by your kitchen grab some water you probably need it just like i don't drink enough water you probably don't drink enough water too especially if it's warm where you are so it's been a while since i gave you guys an update but it's around five o'clock now and basically i had to do math with my dad from like 3 10 to around four o'clock math with parents is just especially with the dad <sighs> you know what i'm saying i'm on my way now i'm on a train to be